Where did you go? I wonder if that tiger just here yet. Whoa. Tigery? Oh, hey, Drafty. Whoa, why is it all alone down here, huh? Oh, nothing. Uh, th listen, do you remember, like, that one friend I would mention from time to time that is, like, in the Lucella military? Um... Oh, wait. Danny Heehaw? Yeah, yeah, Danny Heehaw. Yeah, he was the friend I made back in, like, you know, like, when we were still in school. Well, I just heard that, like, he went missing a few weeks ago and so, you know, like, the Lucella military doesn't know where he went, like, the, any of the members don't even know, like, no one even knows where he went and stuff, you know? And, like, even, like, the most, like, greatest detective of all time in Lucella and stuff, you know, Sherlock Piggy, he even went missing when he was trying to find Danny Heehaw. It's like a whole damn situation. Yeah, I'm just getting anxiety and stuff, you know? I, like, what What if he's, like, dead or something like that? You know, what if someone kidnapped him and just shot him right in the damn head like JFK? I mean, hell, he was one of the friends in my life that kept inspiring me to keep going on and so, stuff. Like, I mean, hell, from time to time, he would, like, you know, call me and stuff, you know, we would talk. And he would, like, quote this inspirational stuff that would make me just, you know, appreciate life even more. Like, I'm pretty sure, like, one time when he was, like, talked to me about, like, an inspirational quote and stuff, he said that you may not always have a happy beginning, but that doesn't mean that, like, the same thing could happen to your ending. I'm just so worried about him and stuff, and next, next you know I'm about to get, get some anxiety attack right on this couch. Oh. Damn. Well, don't worry, Tiger. I'm pretty sure they're gonna be, they're gonna, like, find Danny very soon. You, you really think so? Yep, and I promise on that. Oh, well. Thanks, Drafi. You're always there for us when you when we need it. Well, of course I'm always there for you guys, you know? Because, like, if someone, like, tries to hurt you or something like that, you know, then I'm gonna whack them with my weapon, you know? Now, I'm gonna go see if, like, my package is out there. Besides, it is, like, pouring rain out there, so hopefully it just didn't get wet. What does it mean? What does it mean? What does it mean? What? Come in! Uh, oh, God. Hey, uh, Puggy, you, you busy right now? Oh, Bunny, I think you can tell from my exhaustion. Yes, I am busy right now. Look, I just want to say something really important, okay? Also, what the hell are you doing? Look, the more I thought about, you know, Claus Tukas and his entire crystal orb plan and stuff like that, I've been just gaining a lot more questions about him and stuff, you know? And especially some questions about the crystal orbs, because I'm pretty sure, according to my calculations, like, from different Piggy universes, I'm pretty sure these crystal orbs are supposed to connect to, like, the insolence inside of their universe and stuff. So, if we don't have, like, a Mr. Stitchy or, like, a T or something like that, then what does the crystal orb even connect to, huh? Huh. I mean, you do got a point there. I mean, what is, like, the process of, like, universes and dimensions, like, being created? Huh. You do have some good points there, Puggy. And I mean, what is with the puzzle pieces, like, thing and stuff, you know? Like, the most popular universes becoming puzzle pieces of, like, the, the entire multiverse so that, like, our, like, the smaller universe don't collapse. Like, what does that all mean? Well, I mean, maybe Kona can, like, explain all that. But look, 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 Puggy, I, j I just gotta ask you something really quick. It's important. Okay, well, go on. I'm listening. I'm also kind of busy here. Well, I'm just asking, like, have you, like, had a crush on anybody, especially, like, during our school year or something like that? Uh, no. I always plan to be single. Oh, okay. Good to know. Good to know. Well, um, it's just that there's something I wanted to tell you before, but I just didn't have the strength or, like, the courage to actually tell you, like, when we kind of first met, you know? Like, when I got pushed into a locker. Okay, so... Okay, look, what, what I'm trying to say, what, what I'm trying to exactly say here is I, I kind of, um, I, I have feelings for someone. Oh, you, you have feelings for someone? Well, that, that's great to hear, I guess. Yeah, like, I mean, like, feelings for someone that I kind of knew for a while. Bunny, what do you mean you have feelings for someone you knew for a while? Yeah, I know, it sounds kind of strange and, like, kind of concerning a little bit, but... Look, I, I just want to, like, say something to you that I probably, you know, my young my younger self in school wouldn't possibly say because I didn't have the strength once again, you know. Um, I, uh, uh, I've, I, 
Uh, Bunny, are you good or something? Was there something in the Sour Patch Kid? Hey, from the last time there was nothing. Okay, look, I, uh, mm, mm, ah, mm, uh, 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 Bunny, it sounds like you're sucking on a Tootsie Pop. But what are you trying to say to me? I love, love, love you, loaf. You, you want a loaf of bread? I mean, we have. But I don't, you know, not, not anything about it. I don't think we even have bread and stuff, you know? No, no, it, do, it doesn't mean, I, no. No, I'm not talking about bread. I mean, I love, love. Okay, Bunny, you are kind of wasting my time here. What, love? You love what? Carrots? Like, pony or something? I mean, yeah, sure, like that, yeah. But no, 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 no. I mean, I love, like, someone, like a human, an animal, you know? You, what, you love your mom? You love your dad? Do you love your, like, Sister or I, I I what? No, it's not any of my family members. Not nothing like that, you know. Like I mean, I love love love. Lo, lo, uh, ah! Okay, look, Bunny. Can you like just like talk to me about that like later and stuff, you know? Because I'm kind of busy asking questions and stuff, you know. And probably gonna lower my fucking sanity or I don't know. You know? Yeah, yeah. We'll we'll just we'll just talk about this tomorrow, you know. Like when you're not busy, you know. Hey. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, but I'll see you tomorrow. Uh, I'll see, I'll see you tomorrow. I, I guess. Uh, okay. Who even created Klaus Tukas? Like, like he existed ever since, like you know, the original Piggy universe formed. So, like, what possibly created him at that time? Like, from the process energy or something like that? Like what? Like from like the like the energy of the crystal? Like wh how? Like I generally don't get it. Like is there? Another multiversal god that we don't even know about, like it, uh, like Klaus Tukas or something. Like I don't fucking get it. You, what you could do it tomorrow, honey. Like, like what is even the war between these crystal wars? Like what does it mean? What does it mean? Oh, Pony, I just can't believe that you would do all of this for me. Well, you know me, Sissy. I would do anything for the most prettiest zebra I've ever met in my life. Oh, Pony, you're not a cat. You're a ho like a horse. Well, for you, Sissy, I can be anything you want. Oh, stop it, Pony. You're about to make me blush. We haven't even eaten our food yet. You're right, you're right. Let's just eat our food and then we can do the other stuff later if you know what I mean. Ooh, I see where this is going. Anyways, time to eat my carrots and time to eat my grass. What, what the hell happened to your art? Well, you know what? Despite the differences between us, you're still the most beautiful zebra I've ever met. Oh my god, stop, Bony! You're right, you're right. Yeah, let's, just, let's, just, let's just eat our food, shall we? <laughs> Damn, girl, I didn't know you, know you were like that. Oh, well, you know, I'm always, I'm always like, you know, the serious person in the group and stuff, you know, trying to protect everyone as much as possible and stuff, you know, so... I never really shown the side of me and stuff, you know? And you know, because I'm just around you most of the time. And you know, you're you're not you're not like the other boyfriends I had, you know, back in like high school, middle school and stuff like that, even elementary, you know. Like I had this one I had this one boyfriend who was like one of those like jock like jock bullies, like the leader of the football team and stuff, like those bullies from the Disney channel and stuff, you know. And he just never really treated me right and stuff, you know. I only got him because he looked so cool and stuff, you know, better than anyone else in the school and stuff, you know, but I, I learned later on that you don't need to be cool to be, you know, perfection. I mean, yeah, you're right. I mean, look at you. See, this is why I love you, Pony. And this is why I love you too, Sissy. Ew, are you guys gonna start doing that one kissy part? That's gross. See, Sissy, where'd you guys come from? Well, me and C wanted to get some food, but then, but now, like, we lost our appetite because of you two. Well, we're, we're gonna start dinner soon, so, so go, go, go back to your room. Go go back to your room for like an hour or something like that, and then you can go back down here because we're gonna be in Pony's room. Oh God, I don't even want want to know what's gonna happen next. Come on, see, let's get out of here. Gosh, gay. So, sorry about that, Pony. Oh, no worries, Sissy. It's fine. It's fine. It's not like I like dealt with them like like that multiple times. I mean, once again, Pony, you're just the most. But like, you're just the greatest boyfriend I've ever had and stuff in my entire life. Like, I'm I I'm I'm very sure that like you would never betray me or something like that, you know? You you won't be like one of those crime stories where like the husband stabs their wife like fifth like ninety times and stuff, you know? Like you're you're nothing like that. You're like the perfect person to be in a room with left alone, you know? Oh yeah, you know yeah, yeah, you know me. 
Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm the greatest boyfriend, I, I know, <laughs> Pony, is everything okay? Oh yeah, everything's fine, you know? I just haven't eaten in a while, so I only, like, took a few bites out of this carrot and stuff, you know? So, like, y yeah, we, we should just, like, keep eating and stuff. Well, yeah, you're right. I mean, my stomach is still growling, so... Let's dig in again! Wait, Pony, you are a professional at that. I mean, yeah, it was even my first time doing something like that. Yeah, not gonna lie, Pony, you're, you're just a great, like, you know, person, like, to smash me. I know, tell me about it, especially when I whipped it out, King Didi's hammer, and then smashed you as Kirby in Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. I mean, I'm just still surprised that, like, throughout your whole life, you really never played any video games. I mean, once again, I had, like, a shitty childhood and stuff, so it kind of makes sense, you know? Oh, yeah, right. Yeah, I still feel bad for you. Whoop! <sighs> Jeez, what time is it? The... Oh, dear God, it's like 10 p.m. Jesus, everyone must be asleep already, I guess. Yeah, I think we should probably be going to bed, honestly. Because with all the screaming and yelling, like, when we were smashing and stuff, you know, yeah, we, 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 we would probably wake up the neighbors, like, in a few hours. So, yeah, we should probably go to bed. Yeah, you're right, Pony. Well, good night. Good night, Sizzy. See you tomorrow. And I'm not talking about Mimi. <laughs> oh God! What the hell's that smell? Jesus Christ! It smells like, like sewage water mixed with diarrhea. What the hell? <sighs> Rays. <laughs> I. What? What the? What the fuck did I just encounter? You know what, there's probably something in those Sour Patch Kids I ate before, you know, my little date with Sizzy and stuff, so... I'm just gonna go to bed. I'm, I, yeah, I'm just probably extremely tired. I was probably like sleep paralysis or something, I don't fucking know. Me, 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 me. And I'm not, not talking about Mimi. Good morning, Lucella. Good morning, safe place. Good morning, everyone. And come here, smell. Oh God, it even smells worse from last night. Okay, was I really hallucinating? Was was that like an actual raise or a rat? Well, I, I don't know. Hey, wait, wait. Now I'm hearing something, and it sounds like it's outside of my door. Hmm. You know what? I'm gonna go. Check it out. Yeah, that. I swear to God, if it's seeing Susie trying to prank me again, so hell, oh my God! Ray, Experiencing right now, Pony, is a race infestation. Wait a second, a race infestation? Wait, 
didn't raise like a ride went go like go missing like a few like weeks ago like how is there even multiple of him out there look they're basically just the rats of lucella look, look, look it's not the, that's not the point okay because you've been eating too much carrots recently you've been leaving crumbs everywhere that that led the raises here wait so all those all those raises out there are just like inside of the safe place because I've been leaving crumbs everywhere because I've been eating too much carrots? Yes, not because of your addiction, we're in this mess. I was even one of the first people to actually wake up and stuff, you know, because like of all the noises of the raises just saying, raise, raise, and all that stuff. So I had to fight my way down here because I heard you screaming and yelling and stuff about all the raises and stuff like that, you know? And that's when I knew that you were the second person to wake up. And from what it looks like, not everyone else is wake, well, waking up right now. Wait, so what are you trying to say? I'm saying, Pony, that we need that you and me need to work together to get like everyone in the safe place out of here and stuff, you know? Like the, like seeing Susie, Mimi, you, you, you know, like we need to save our friends during this race infestation and then we're probably going to have to live some we're going to have to like live somewhere else for a while, you know? Because you know, there's like so much raises and there's like goddamn safe place and stuff, you know? And an exterminator is probably going to take a while to get rid of all of them, you know? What? Hold on. Go out there? No, 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 no. I, I am not doing that. Do, didn't you see how much races there were out there? Oh, well, don't you worry, Pony. I got myself an idea. See, Pony? It's just easy as pie. Wait, so all the races are gone on this floor? Uh-huh. And besides, uh, the elevator is kind of broken right now, so they're probably going to be stuck there for a while. But the bad news is um, that was kind of my last cheese block I even had and stuff, so uh, we're going to need to find like different ways to get rid of the races in each on each floor and stuff. So anyways, get your wooden sword and stuff, you know, because we're probably going to have to fight some races all along the way, and let's go save our friends and get the fuck out of here. What did I get myself into? Oh, shit. Well, let me get my one. Sorry, first. Me, come on! We're getting the hell out of here! Take this, you fiend! <clears throat> you guys want it? You rats want it? You raises want it? Well, go get it! <laughs> Dumbasses. Wakey, wakey, eggs, and bakey, sleeping beauty! Come on, we gotta get out of here! Uh, 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 huh? Uh, Me! Okay, okay. See you, Susie. It's time to get our butts out of here now. Uh, 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 what the fuck? Uh, oh, I need ice cream. I'm sad. Who the hell is this guy? Honey, watch out! That's a raise! It's gonna kill you! <clears throat> what, what the hell? What's happening? Listen, I'll explain later. Just, just escape the safe place while you can. There's many raises running around. Raises? What are you? Oh, that's what it is. He 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 he. Raise. He he he. No. Not too. Huh? What? Uh, Pony? What? What's going on? Who, who, who's this person? Listen, Georgia. There's no time to explain. J just follow me real quick. We're we're getting out of here. Uh, uh, okay, okay then. Uh, uh, uh. Oh my God! I still don't get it. Hold on. Anyways, well, what does this all mean? I, I said hold on. Damn. Okay. Anyway. Oh my god, okay, that is it! Bunny, I already told you that I'm at- I'm busy at- WHAT THE FUCK?! Rafi's here to save the day! Ugh. Yeah, wait. What the- I- What?! Okay, look, Puggy, enough with your little, like, Game 3 moments, just come on, we're getting out of here! What- where'd you even go? Did you face for the wall or something? Ooh. Ooh. Okay. I- I think that- that was everyone, right? Yeah. 
Now I think I should start going. Raise. Raise. Especially since I'm starting to hear more raises. I gotta, I gotta get out of here. Honestly, I don't really know where, where else we're going. Oh my god! Raise. Raise. Oh shit, what am I gonna do? 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 Why didn't you leave them? Uh, never mind. What am I gonna do? Think of your bullies. Think of your bullies from high school. Think of your bullies from high school. Think of your bullies from high school. <laughs> wow, you're such a nerd. Give us all your money, you loser woozer. Uh, I'm not a loser woozer! <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. Oh dear. Well, they're taken care of. I mean, there's still some raises inside of that, inside of the safe place and stuff, so. Yeah, I mean, some of them are in, like, the elevator, like, broken elevator, so, um. Yeah, we didn't get all of them. Well, damn, Pony, you literally, you literally sliced those, um, two raises in half, and we can't really show it because of budget cut reason. Yeah. Yeah, I did do that, and thankfully we're all alive, so yeah. Did somebody call the exterminator? Jesus Christ, where the hell did you come from? We, we didn't even call you yet. Well, from what I heard from the 10 mile radius, it seems that you guys encountered a race infestation in sort of your little safe place you had. Because from what I sense and smell from the past, it seems that someone has been leaving crumbs of the of the vegetable carrots around the safe place. And because of that, the raise infestation happened. But it seems that uh, it, but it seems that the po little pony boy and and like that giraffe were able to save you all before I even arrived. Well, yeah, but I'm pretty sure there's still some raises inside of, you know, the safe place. Um, we weren't able to, you know, like, 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 get rid of all of them and stuff, so... Hey, hey, don't you worry, puppy old boy. I am the exterminator of Lucella. I can exterminate anything, like mouses, raises, rats, rodents, you know? Is there anything you want me to exterminate? And believe me, this is not the first time I even exterminated some raises, you know? A lot more raids infestations have been happening for at Lucella, and we don't even know why. And it seems like you guys are not the only one that encounter it. But because I'm gonna have to exterminate the raises remaining inside of the safe place, it's probably gonna take me a few weeks. So in the meantime, um, the safe place will be on lockdown, and you guys basically just need to find somewhere else to live for a while. Wait, we're gonna have to live somewhere else for a while? But like, but like the safe place is like a home to us and stuff, you know? Like, we're always there to hang out. Well, I mean, you can just live in the safe place and stuff with a lot of raises trying to kill you with their, like, spike arms and stuff. To be honest, we still don't know why these, like, raises still have fucking spikes to his arms and stuff. But either you could just do, like, just live there and stuff while getting murdered by the rats, or you can just live somewhere else for a while. Okay, you know, you know, fine, we'll, we'll live somewhere else, but we don't, we don't exactly know where else to live. Well, maybe live in a hotel for a while, or like a motel or something like that, you know, or live at a friend's house, I don't know. I mean, we could live, I mean, we could all live in my house and stuff, but I don't, but... I mean, I don't really like guests or fizzers and stuff like that. I kind of like my peace and quiet when it comes to my house and stuff. But especially you can't, you know, like live inside Tigri's house and stuff, you know, because that that house, from what I saw, like it it was just small as fuck, honestly. And besides, I'm pretty sure, like, yeah, Tigri's like back at his house and stuff. So like, yeah, and he's probably still sleeping. Like he doesn't even know that that's even happening right now. And also, Doggy doesn't even have a house at this point because he got evicted from what he said from like you know like like a few days ago. Well, that's not really my problem. So you could just like try to like like pay for like yeah, probably just try to pay to like like stay somewhere for a while. Or just, you know, live on the streets for a little bit, you know? I mean, that's what I had to do, like, when I when I was, like, born and shit like that. But in general, you are not gonna be able to, um, go back into the safe place until further notice. Once the- once the raises are all gone, then it's safe to go in. Now, if you excuse me, I have to do some raises to exterminate.
so we're gonna have to live on the streets and eat trash like homeless men well we're obviously not gonna live on the streets and stuff you know i mean we guys we, we have enough money to like you know live in a hotel for a few weeks right right please, please don't tell me we're all in debt wait a second you know what I think I actually have some friends from, like, when I was, at like, a ca like a camp counselor at the Lucilla camp and stuff, you know? Um, I'm pretty sure they have this, like, little, like, base they have where they you basically just live at, live at and stuff, you know? So maybe they'll actually, you know, like, let us, um, actually live there for a few weeks and stuff. I'm, I'm pretty sure they won't mind. Draffy, did, did, weren't you, like, a Lucilla camp counselor, like, like, a f like, ten decades ago? Like, or no, like... Or, like, only a decade ago and stuff. Yeah, yeah. weren't you, like, a camp counselor, only, like, only, like, a decade ago and stuff? Like, do you, do you even still have those, count, like, other counselors' number, like, contacts or something like that? Oh, yeah, me and the other counselors still talk from time to time and stuff, you know? They they still even work at the Lucilla camp, like, after all these years. Well, yeah, once again, I'm pretty sure they won't even mind if we, like, actually live at, the, live at their little base they have for a little bit. Huh. Okay, then. Well, that's what we're going to do, I guess. I guess we're just gonna live at... Draffy's friends, like, base they have, I I guess. Yeah, and now that I think about it, I'm pretty sure I do actually remember where, like, the location actually is. So, if you guys just follow me and stuff, we, we can be there in no time and stuff, you know? And, yeah, I'll basically just explain everything to them, and they, yeah, they'll just, they'll just, like, let us live there for a little bit. So, yeah, let, yeah, let's go, guys, come on! Oh, man, I wanted to throw a, a, a like, a hot honey bun at, like, a homeless man. Oh, man. Welp. Looks like this is gonna be a new chapter for all of us. But Pony? Look, I didn't know, okay? I I swear to you, I didn't know! Pony! Uh huh, what? Pony, who the hell are you talking to? Uh, no, nothing. L let's just follow Draffy, okay? Jeez, okay. 